everyone, Kathy here with Buffalo Check Chicks. Today I have a super simple garden craft for you. Um, I bought these bowls. They are from Dollar Tree and there was four for $1.25. And I got these tumblers from Walmart. I think they were a quarter or 50 cents, I don't remember. Very cheap. And I got the paint. I've had this paint for a while. Um, and what I'm going to do is make mushrooms. I'm going to paint the top of this one yellow and the top of this one red. And I have this here to make the polka dots for the mushrooms. I hope it comes out good and I hope it doesn't look like uh, mustard and ketchup because that's what it looks like to me right now. I really didn't want to change the color of these tumblers. I think it'll be fine. Or maybe I'll switch it up and do this top red and that top yellow. I don't know. But anyway, I wanted to um, do something quick and easy and cheap for my garden. All right, I'm going to... Um, I'm going to paint the tops of these and then I'm going to Mod Podge them just so um, it makes it a little bit more weatherproof and I'll be back. Alright guys, so I'm done painting them. Um, like I said, I put a coat of the Mod Podge on the bowl first. I put two coats of the yellow, a coat, or actually two coats of the white because it's a little bit see-through. And then I didn't glue them on yet, but it's still going to look the same when I, glue, when I glue them on. So I just figured I'd show you them now. And um, I didn't use that sponge brush thingy. I just painted the circles on because the spon sponge brush circular thingy, whatever it's called, was not working right. So um, I just painted them on. They're not perfect, but... Still, I think they came out good, and I'm just going to put some E6000, and that'll be that. I'll put them outside. And um, this paint I bought a couple weeks ago. I love the green. It's pretty. And I figured I would paint these little terracotta pots. I was thinking about maybe making those mushrooms also. But um, I did put a coat of the Mod Podge on first. And now this is already two coats of that, and it keeps doing, I don't know, keeps taking the paint off for some reason. I thought the Mod Podge would help that situation, but maybe another coat would be good. And I'm not sure yet if I'm going to make those. I think they're too short. I might just make them um, pretty, um, pretty little pots and put some little plants in them for outside. All right, guys, don't mind my mess with uh, my paint everywhere. <laughs> Um, I'm done. I decided to decorate them. I thought they were a little bit plain and I went through my stash and they had all these cute stickers. These are just pretty sure from Dollar Tree. So I went ahead and I put the little ladybugs in different spots here. Uh-oh. I see some paint I got on there. I'll have to take that off. Um, so I put one on top. And I just went around and put a few here and there. And I did glue this on with E6000. And then I had the little bees, some left over from Dollar Tree. And I put some bees. Boy, I got paint everywhere. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, so anyway, I'll fix that too. So I decorated them, and I think they look cute. And then those other terracotta pots, I painted them. I still need to paint a little bit more. This is about the fourth coat of paint that I put on these. These are so pretty, but I don't know. I don't know if it's the pots that I'm painting or if it's the paint. But um, this one's light green from Dollar Tree. And then this one is the powder blue. And I love the colors, but yes, I did several, several coats. And then I decided to put stickers, and I had these stickers for a long time. I'm not even sure where I got them. 
But anyway, I put the stickers on there. And I am going to seal this with some Mod Podge after I'm done painting those. But I thought they came out really cute. So that's it, guys. I want to thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye for now.